Hi guys. Today this lesson related to script. It means AutoCAD script. It means we can draw some object by the command. The main idea so of this right. Uh, before the session, I just do recall the command. First line. First, uh, I am going to click here. The two methods are there. First one is the graphical method and the command from the method, right? So, I'm first time typing here the command from line, right? Type line. The command you should remember because we have to use this command in the script file. So, click on line. Then asking the first point, right? going to give 0, 0 that means that uh, line especially next point oh, the, the next point is I'm going to give uh, 20, 0 20, 0 then enter OS okay. right, so now this is the our line, this is our line length is 20 how we can get this? We call it the dim line here. Then first point, then second point, then third. Right? This is the dim line. Now for the our line length is 20. Now I am going to draw this line by the command. This is the trick. Right? So that you can you have to open the notepad so you can type it here the notepad the notepad is uh, very easy so i am going to open this notepad you can open it. the notepad file is very here so notepad is automatically open right now right. we have the notepad now i am going to write my command First, I am going to type my command as line, then starting point as 0, 0, enter the next point, 10, oh sorry, 20, 0, then enter the line is wrong. <coughs> right, now we can check this, copy this, right, paste here, the paste, line here, right, okay. Now, I am going to save this notepad file as this file. So, I am going to give a save as, right? It's already in text mode, the text mode. So, I am going to give the older. Then, my command is line, so line, so str. You can enter any other name, so no problem. But the, the, the exception should be like this. But but I already created the line script, so I'm saying this RK has already exit. Do you want to? Like, yes, I am. Right, it's already there. Let me mic. Now, in command from type it to the R. Then it says, this RK, where is your file? This script. So I am selecting. So, I am selecting. So, this is the one. Right. So, repeat. Right? Because he didn't give here, I didn't give here any other enter command, only one command. So that the, uh, this is not completed in life from this uh, end. Now the command is getting uh, set. The command is underscore c right which i am going to miss right then i am going to give this point here c and uh line right and going to save this right in my but I didn't 
give a point so for here here you can enter the end point so i am going to the end point is out like this the second line here yeah. that's why this distance this distance by coordinate you can receive by coordinate so you can see here <coughs> click on my near uh, click on my power pad and my uh, three five then i am going to give the x value is zero because i don't want to give any uh, y equal to zero or not Now I have prepared a layer a script, the practice script. This is the line, which is start from zero to zero, then uh, to ten comma zero, then uh, from that point uh, it will start the thirty degree angle but twenty distance. The comma is here, the axis, the rate of the distance. And the angle, right? This is the simple for angle. Then enter. After that, I uh, type in the command redeem align. Then the starting point is zero, ten, ten comma zero. And to go to the the the, the inclined align, inclined line, the thirty degree. Then uh, the place the text uh, from that particular line to ten distance. Then enter. Then I uh, then uh, after that I am entering the dim line command. Uh, then uh, this command is working from zero to zero and zero to ten. Then the distance is ten. So and enter. This is the main command. Right now uh, I am save it. Uh, the zip file. Now I am going to load this file. So type S E R. Then enter. Just select this of practice again. I mean, this zip file the load is uh, easier, it's automatically gone. But I didn't enter this uh, particular command, so I'm going to delete this one and go to my script file. Uh, see here, I just entered it. So, enter. So, every entry is very important. Just now, to enter and see it. Then, now I'm going to again type the CR and enter. To select the file like this. Oh, nice! So how we can work it or work on it is script. So very easy, right? Uh, if you want to draw a circle, likewise you can make a circle. Then I am going to here the make a circle to enter. I'm the command is the circle C A R C L E. Circle to us at the box or otherwise you can normally. The circle starting point uh, at a zero comma zero. Then the radius. Uh, so I'm going to type the diameter. Then diameter is going to be uh, ten. Uh, then enter. Save. Now I'm going to execute this. We uh, uh, so delete it all this thing and type S D R. Then enter. So I'm going to type this. So. Okay, wait. I am going to check this one. The circle is correctly work, work or not? Copy. Then paste it here. This is perfect. So something happened with here. So I paste this one. I am going to execute this one. So type the here. Then enter. Like this. Now, it's pretty the measurement. 
and also the NBA. Right? The problem is that they the, the enter the enter because the this time it is all, all automatically enter in this point. Right? That's the perfect plan. Now I am going to the measure this distance. You can uh, go to the diameter tap or radius tap. So now I am going to give the radius of the silicon radius then click it. So now type on F2. Here the dim, dim radius the command. The dim radius. You select the arc or circle. Dim text type. Now I am going to be. Uh, I am going to copy this uh, dim radius. Right. I'm going to my script file. Then uh, enter the dim radius. Type it here. So I know the radius. Right. So I know the radius is five. So type it five and enter the save right and i'm saved now i'm going to delete all these things and type it here the fcr the enter the price yeah the placing point yes the placing point is asking the placing point if you want you can make it placing point so otherwise the, the user user can input this one. right here this is uh, so if you want to make it uh, by coordinate uh, you can also make it but uh, this is manual is better so the item by which location is suitable for this uh, area but so the main idea of the script is those and uh, something happened uh, now you can see here i'm going to explain a guide okay, this is my script file right first I'm going to prepare a line. I do this is line command, then starting from 0, 0, then ending point. Uh, ending not at any point, this point. So just from 0, then the line. Uh, incline angle 30, position 20, then this alignment, in alignment. So starting from 0, zero then the incline angle is 30 degrees for 20 seconds, and the pacing dimension has 10. Then going to dim line here, then starting from 0, 0 and uh, 0, 10, 0, the distance is 10, so I am putting the place, the placing, it is a this here, the placing text, so the dim text is at the, at the distance of okay. then place the activate the command circle, then going to give the circle and turn point to 0, 0, then enter the distance diameter then give the diameter 10 and diameter radius the uh, measuring tool then radius and 5 but uh, I'm here for choose the uh, input I'm making here so I didn't enter twice but only one thing because of the choose the input so control it okay let's load it again type SDR then enter let's click on try this automatically asking where is the point you want and it's here right this is the main idea behind the script okay. I hope uh, you will understand about this script uh, okay uh, you can practice it and uh, next video I will put a larger or complex shape or complex measurement then how we can prepare the five for those boys thank you please subscribe my channel